Okay, it is Tuesday the 22nd, and I haven't ridden her in a couple days, so we have to do a ride. We have to. Bugs are terrible. Good girl, let me go this way. The bugs are terrible today. The fence is not on. Good girl. I don't want my leg to get caught there. I was thinking about coming out here and we'll just ride around these bushes. You're a good girl, you. Ugh, bugs are horrible. Good girl, mama. Good girl, mama. Yeah, you're getting snorty. I don't like that. So we'll go back to where you feel safe and secure. Yeah, it's windy. It's cooler out today. She did not want me to catch her today. So I didn't. I just let her in here and I just brushed her and did some tea touch. I didn't want her to get angry with me. You know, I'm just going to work on walking. I'll just feel at the walk, my body moving. I'll just walk her in here. Good girl. You don't like it over there. There's a lot of obstacles in here. Can we walk past him or is he going to get mad at you? Good girl. Let's just walk. Good job. Good mama. Good mama. Come on, let's walk. She's like, we done? No, we're not done yet. We're not done yet. Come on now, mama. Yeah, I don't know what her deal was lately. What are you looking at? What are you looking at? You're all weird. Here, let's practice putting your head down. Yeah, good girl. Put your head down. Put your head down. They're setting off like firecrackers next door. I don't know what they're doing. I wanted to take them out for a trail ride today, but it isn't going to happen with the cold and her being misbehaving. And let's walk. You're walking on. Oh, because something's bugging her. Okay. Good job. Let's walk on. Move on. I don't want you to back up, lovies. Come on, walk forward. Good girl. Feels like it's going to rain. Why are you walking me into the fence? Here, side pass over. See, this is what happens when I haven't ridden her for like a week. Not listening to me at all. And I hear buzzing coming from that whole bunch of... Walk over your stick. Good girl. I don't like walking past there. So we're just going to stay in this little clear area, area here. Yeah, you're a good baby mare. Good mare. We worked all week long on... Step over your log. Good girl. I don't know. Okay. I don't always trust him. He is a kicker, but maybe he won't kick out of his mare. Can you walk around this way? Navigate the obstacles, mares. There's a lot of them. Good job. Good job. No, this is part of trail riding. Just going through all these obstacles because I'm a slob back here. Come on. She's like, I really don't want to give you a ride today, Mommy. I really wanted to ride you. It's like when you're married and you just don't have sex for such a long time that you just get to where you're just never having sex with your partner. I don't want that to happen with me and her. You know, if I didn't get to ride her for a week, I don't want to like let another week of not being on her go, even if it's just a quickie or even if we're just walking. Good girl. Good job, mama. You know, I just want to be having a connection with her at some point. We don't have to go fast. You've got you to get your side pass away from the fence, though. Come on. Good girl. You have to listen to my legs. Oh, I walk nice. Good girl. What are you stopping for? Come on. Walk through the brush. 
I heard bees in here, so go quick. There you go. Come on. I'm not doing much with her today. I just want to feel her. We don't have an arena. This is our arena. Good job. Good girl. Side over. There you go. Good job. Good job. So my hands are going with her head moving at the walk. My hips are going with her. And we have a nice little walk going. That's a good girl. Yeah. And I think that she wants to be done because I'm going to make this a quick video just because she just did everything I wanted. That was a nice. You did good, Mama. You did good. So we're going to just park it. Good job. Yeah. She's like, you got to be over with me now, Mama. Okay, up you go. Good job. Yes. Good job. Yeah, I don't know what her deal was today. But, you know, she's like, I'm too busy to be bothered with you. Oh, by the way, because she was ignoring me, I took him out, walked him down, and hosed him off. And she had a one minute of thinking about anxiety and then was like, eh. Eh, went back to the grass. <laughs> so I really think that today was one of those days where she just she didn't want to spend time with her mom. And I felt rejection. But that's okay. Yeah. We just got a quickie in. Okay. Okay. Where are you going now? The grass is way more important to her right now. Baby, can I take your saddle off? Oh, mama. Come on, sweet mama. She's like... I gotta get back to my grass and that's okay, you can come. Now mommy take your saddle off in there. I don't to get the saddle off the back. Just on a recent video from Ryan. I don't remember his last name. I usually link his videos below. He's a really good trainer. Very good trainer. Uh, I think it's Ryan Rose, I want to say, but I don't, I could be wrong. Young, young man and his, I think his wife's like a, does a lot of riding too. So they're a good, they're a good team. But his training method is awesome. He was doing with how to put a saddle on. It was how to put a Western saddle on. This is a dressage saddle, but it doesn't matter what saddle it is. I slid it off the back this time, and that's what he had said to do. And so I did it, and I like it. And even though it's not a Western saddle, I think she liked it too. She's going back to ignoring me. Hey, that's mares for you, you know. I got my little sweet little ride from my lady. I got to wash his stinky butt crack, because he was disgusting. He's no now dry and freshly pooping it back up again you are you're all you feel nice you feel nice it sounds like they're shooting some kind of a gun off next door like a it's loud it's loud enough that um, it's a loud enough gun pop that oh yeah jake's in my car because I wasn't sure if she was going to have a meltdown or not in here. And I didn't want Jake to be trapped in the cage. So she basically ran up here and back and went back to eating grass. So I don't know what kind of mindset set she's in. She was pretty nice and calm to ride. She just was occupied with herself. She's just like in her own little self-absorbed, I want to eat grass acelito kind of mood i don't have cookies but i'm gonna go to the grocery store and get you some i promise i know i told you i would do that and then i didn't i'm going to <sighs> yeah so that's my little quickie ride at the farm this is what i do when my horse doesn't want to be around me i kind of ignored her then i did tea touch with her because i wanted her to feel good before our ride so while i was tacking her up i did some tea touch on her and then i just did my thing and it's actually it's actually raining out so we're gonna over and out it because it's gonna start raining harder i can feel it it's coming down more over and out the mare